Chelsea is one of the veteran YouTube creators, and today she's gonna to share with you her top pro tips. For those of you guys who are trying to grow a channel, she got hers at one and a half million subscribers, and Instagram, and other social stuff. She's, you wanna hear what she's got to say, it's coming up. Hey guys, my name is Tim Schmoyer and welcome to Video Creators. This channel is all about helping you guys grow your YouTube audience so you can spread a message that reaches people and changes their life, which is what Chelsea's very passionate about and I am too. So you have an amazing channel. Thank you. One and a half million subscribers, doing lots of things. A lot of people just love what you do. What are some of the pro tips that you have for these creators who would love to get to where you're at, where you are with your channel and your business and your audience? I'd say probably one of the biggest things is actually taking advice from the people that have seen a lot of success but also haven't seen success and like Tim who uploads videos like all the time of like Things that I, I, I don't know how you come up with like, <laughs> the ideas constantly. I am not but, paying her to say this, but, but uh, I do like this tip. <laughs> but like, I for the longest time, like, just thought I knew everything. Like, I was like, oh, like my channel's doing well. Like, I'll just continue to do the same thing. Like, and it'll do well. And then YouTube changed, and it just didn't do as well and I'm still trying to figure out like how to keep up but also remain who I am and spread the message that I want to spread and so actually like investigate and watch videos that you think will help you and your channel but stay true to the message that you want to portray on your channel and stay true to obviously who you are. Don't allow your message and who you are to be complete, total, two different things because yeah. that's not authentic. Another thing that you talk a lot about is reinventing yourself. Tell us a little bit about that tip for these guys. So I, I haven't necessarily addressed this on my channel, but it's something that you can naturally see throughout the years on my channel because I started doing makeup, fashion, all that sort of stuff, and now I do more lifestyle vlog and faith-based videos because that's what I care about and I just want to encourage you guys to do videos that you actually care about and if you are known for doing DIYs on your channel but that's just not what you're passionate about anymore then move in a direction that's more of what you actually care about. If you're just starting out on your channel and you might be a little discouraged as to what message am I even really sharing or like where do I start? I'm so passionate about this, this, and this. You're not really tied to just doing one sort of video. Like that's the beauty of YouTube. You can do whatever you want and make it about you. Also, with other social media platforms, if you already have a social media following on Instagram, Twitter, Facebook, drive your platforms there over to your YouTube channel. Some people might be like, oh my gosh, starting a YouTube channel, that's so weird. But also, like, I continued to do it in middle school when I got made fun of for it. So, I mean, <laughs> look where I am now. Suckers. So. <laughs> Tell them where they can shove it and move on. <laughs> In a very polite, respectful yes, way, of course. Yes. <laughs> if you guys want to learn more about Chelsea and watch her as she evolves on this journey, there's a link down below. Our interactive card around here pop up. You can go check out her channel. We want to hear from you guys what some of your pro tips are for growing your channel. And this is your first time here at Video Creators. We'd love to have you subscribe. Every Monday, Tuesday, Thursday, we have new videos here just to help you guys grow your YouTube audience so you can spread a message that reaches people and changes their lives. So thank you for letting us be a small part of that. Subscribe, and we'll see you guys again on Monday. I have gone through a lot of transitional times in my life where for three months I didn't upload on YouTube. So I put it to the side and I said, I need to get, I need to get well, I need to, I need to just put myself first for once. 